The DIOP infant test is a rapid and simple way to measure visual acuity of an infant, child, or nonverbal adult. Identical size DIOPs are displayed on opposite sides of the monitor, but only one of them is rotating. The typical response is to notice the one which is rotating rather than the static DIOP. The child should sit close enough to the monitor, approximately three feet or less, to ensure the head or eye movements noticeably changes when tracking the location of the spinning diop. As the examiner makes the diops incrementally smaller, the location of the rotating diop alternately switches. The child's head or eyes will naturally move from side to side to track that rotating diop. When that rotating diop gets too small, the child's head or eyes will either rapidly move from side to side or may not move at all trying to unsuccessfully locate that rotating diop. A verbal child might typically blurt, it's disappeared. When that diop rotation has disappeared, make the diops slightly larger until the child is again able to track the location of that rotating diop. That smallest diop where motion tracking is detected is the acuity endpoint. The infant acuity endpoint directly correlates to adult acuity. You can validate that acuity endpoint by moving the child away from the monitor to see if they lose the ability to track that rotation, or by moving the child closer to the monitor to see if the child can again detect rotation of that smaller diop. The ability to detect rotation of a blue on black diop, better than the same diameter green on white diop, indicates a higher ratio of red to green photoreceptors and a potential for symptoms of dyslexia, migraines, and or epilepsy. Chart 2020 and DIOP, revolutionizing the way eyes are tested.